Patrol has more than a dozen migrants in custody after they say they tried to land in Juneau Beach and in fact did make the shoreline. Also, the men and women coming from Haiti, the Bahamas and Turkey were told. News Channel 5's Gabrielle Saran is live at the Border Patrol Station in Riviera Beach with what she is learning today. Gabrielle. Michael, right now, 13 migrants are detained here. Border Patrol agents are questioning them, hoping to figure out how they got here and whether any of them might have a criminal history. After three long hours, this is how it ended for this man from the Bahamas. Sheriff's deputies led him out of the mangroves along A1A in handcuffs. Just minutes before, a deputy drew his gun before the man came out. All the other police cars came and everything. And it was, as I said, the young guys dressed in black. They were the ones with, in the bushes. Margaret Lucas was walking home to her condo when she saw and heard what was happening. I heard the helicopters. And we're going all over, over, over. And I thought, my goodness, what's going on? This is exclusive Chopper 5 video of the small fishing boat washed ashore near MacArthur Park on Singer Island. U.S. Border Patrol says this man, likely the person driving the boat, was one of 13 undocumented men and women aboard now in custody. I can't believe it. I feel so bad for them, you know, because they have to pay to get into the country. And it just dropped them off here. The search began around 9 this morning when Jupiter police detained several migrants near Juno Beach Park. From there, Palm Beach County Sheriff's deputies, Riviera Beach police, and U.S. Border Patrol agents scoured the area with dogs on the ground and a helicopter in the air. Just after 12 noon, an ambulance arrived. The boat's driver appeared dehydrated and was loaded onto a stretcher. It's a sight Zareda Velez and her family say is hard to see. I do know that they're coming actually just to, you know, find a better way of life. And Border Patrol says there were no injuries. They also say the group will likely be deported back to their home countries. We're live in Riviera Beach. Gabrielle Saran, WPTV, News Channel 5.